Yes, general ward on. We're done. Okay, we now have a hospital. Hello, guys, and welcome to my first look at Hospitalized with me, Biffa. Thank you for joining me. How do we describe Hospitalized? Well, it's out on Steam now, early access. It's eleven ninety nine if you wish to check that out. Eleven pounds ninety nine, a couple more in dollars, of course. It says find the most effective way to construct and manage a hospital. So a bit like RimWorld, a bit, you know, that sort of thing. You're building rooms, we're managing the things. Let's just start it off and we can see what it's like. So Biffa, uh, we're going to call it Hope Biffa, the hospital. Let's start our brand new hospital. And what are we going to do here? We are going to start working on, uh, let's just slow this down a little bit and work through the tutorial. So. Let's see, middle mouse button, WASD, zoom in and out, Q&E. Yep, that's fine, we got that one. Game speed, one, two, three, four. One is pause. I wish they'd make space pause. Oh, there we go, you can. But have that one, two, three, four. Games keep having one as pause, it's confusing. <laughs> anyway, there we go, that's fine. So, we have construction. We can construct doors, floors, walls things to go in medical options decoration furniture it is early access so there will be more things added as we go and as we add rooms then we can assign the different types of uses for the room which we'll see as we go along so this is going to take us through building a few things so let's close that menu here and we have reputation of our hospital so every time a patient leaves they will be looked at uh, to see whether they've had their needs met and our reputation will grow or shrink uh, positive effect, correct diagnosis, effective treatment, nice environment, incorrect. You know, so there's positives and negatives towards dealing with patients. Death obviously being a very bad one. So, yeah, want to avoid that if at all possible. Uh, invoice and money. I'm not going to read through all of this. I want to get just to the building part and then you can look at that. But people pay for their services. Um, and there we go. And we get the different rooms. So let's construct our first room, hotkey F1. Uh, open the construction tab, select the structure category, we do have that. Select the white wall, draw a 6x6 large square on the map. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I'm going to go a bit bigger. Because why not? There we go, and let's get the game running, and these guys will go and build that, and that's cost me some money. So, we need to wait for them to build that. We're going to have, there we go items turning up so this reminds me a bit of prison architect that sort of thing rimworld a little bit in there as well perhaps that sort of top down management style game um, the one thing i would say at the moment even though it is in early access so obviously things would change any bugs that you see it's being worked on all the time um when you're waiting for things to be built it can take a bit too long I think that's one of my first opinions I've played through this already you will see now on the fastest speed there is they have to visit each square twice so they visit it once then they visit it to take the parts and then they have to build it up so down here this will be the second or third time they've gone there I think it's the second then they'll have to go again oh we need to put a door here don't we let's can I change that to a door will that get rid of the wall that was there oh we can rotate as well with R there we go. So you can put doors and walls in the sides and things. In fact, I'm going to put a door here because I know we're going to need another room off the side. Uh, select door. Place a counter in the middle of the room. Oh, let's do that. Um, so let's have a look. What have we got here? Decoration. Furniture. We need a counter. There we go. Let's face it that way. This is going to be where people come in and talk to the patients. There we go. Talk to the receptionist, I mean. Yes, they put the doors in correctly for me. Excellent. So let's just slow things down a bit again. Press R. Place a door on a wall. Close construction tab. F1. Done. Oh, they're going to build that last thing. Excellent. So now they've constructed it. That's right. We can speed things up. So now we need to set what this room is going to be. So we want this to be a reception area. If it's got this hashed area, it's not been accepted as anything yet. Um, we want to make this room. Let's have a look. So these are the rooms, this is the one we've currently selected, these are the options that we have. So we want reception area for here. It tells you here the required size, so 9 to 192, well that's fine, we've done a, what did we end up with, 7 by 7, so that's big enough. It would be red if it wasn't, so let's do laboratory, there we go. This won't work as a laboratory, it's red, we need those items in. So we've got help, we can have it as a reception area, so there we go, let's change that. 
and that shows that is on so if you come out of that menu do some other stuff come back click on this room it shows you the reception area is on for that room so there we go oh look they're leaving footprints at least the doors are working so we've done that reception area if we reconstruct doors or walls we would have to reassign and set that i'm assuming once you've got a load of rooms you would just put this on see that should be assigned reception off on i thought it wouldn't show up the hashtag once it was done but there we go well to open the hospital for patients let's move along uh, we also need an office adjacent to here so let's build an office uh, what do we need in an office let's check a desk an office chair a chair and it's got to be at least four by four okay so that's fine we can do that so let's build or let's skip this forward uh, build the required room and objects yeah okay that's fine it's just telling us to get on with it well we can do that here uh, one two three four let's go sort of let's not go too big let's go like that we've got to fit some items in here as well in fact let's how do we sell I'm gonna make this slightly bigger don't put the parts there there we go let's make this one a bit bigger let's speed that up I'm gonna go down here instead there we go excellent so they'll get building that so what do we need to put in here for an office we need a desk an office chair and a chair so let's have a look uh, desk so this is going to be the doctor's desk so i reckon we could have that over here in the corner they walk in straight away see the doctor over here this would be better desk an office chair let's have that face in the desk and a chair for the patient to sit in let's face that towards there there we go so that should be everything we need in there wait for the workers to finish open the room assignments we'll do that when they're done i think you just have to i thought that hashing would go once it's selected but i suppose that's just showing you the room that you've got selected at the moment isn't it okay fair enough so we can have that as office once they finish the walls we will select that while they're doing that i'm gonna have a sip of tea one second i've done some walls down here we didn't actually need to do <laughs> let us remove that wall because they can't get out look <laughs> let's uh no i don't want to fire you i want to select the wall you move out the way please there we go let's sell that one they're like move please move let's sell that one and let's sell that one <laughs> ah, there we go what a mistake of the maker okay so now we've got in here we want this to be an office so i think that should be big enough don't tell me i've made it not big enough white wall one two three four five one two three four five yeah one two three four four yeah it's big enough so that should be fine desk office chair and chair desk office chair and chair okay well anyway we've got that set as office i think that will kick in in a moment i think that happened to me before where it, it says it isn't ready for that type of thing but it does there we go okay it's working now good so we've done that one we've assigned the usage one last thing we need if they have to stand around while they're waiting to see the doctor they won't be happy so we need to combine this with a waiting room and if we look down here at waiting room we need chairs in here so that's fine we can add some chairs uh, let's go to furniture let's add let's make this a nice waiting area so let's have chair there chair there chair there chair there chair there maybe one more there we go they're going to come in and build those we have an email actually let's open this increase your reputation to 87 okay well we haven't opened the hospital yet can i oh okay we can't finish it until we've done it okay now that makes sense there we go they've done that place a few chairs assign waiting room okay let's assign waiting rooms of this let's have a look is that going to be here there we go yes we can do that reception on waiting room on no problem at all just checking that one's still working for office yep so now we can open our hospital 
Hire a doctor and a nurse to tend to all of our patients. Open the staff panel. Yes, of course, we need to do that. <laughs> Open the staff panel. Select applicants and hire at least one doctor and one nurse. Uh, hire. Fire follow. Okay. Applicants. That's what we need. Profession doctor. Okay, so can we, we just click on that and hire him? Okay, we've hired a doctor, looks like. And we need to hire a nurse. Skill discipline, let's go for this one here. They've got a cost per day. Excellent. Oh, I see, as we've hired him, more have come in. Good, so if we look here, employees. Oh, oh man, we have lots of employees. What are all these? Caretaker, 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 doctor, caretaker, caretaker, doctor, nurse. Yeah, we've got them. You are now ready to receive ones in here. Oh, here comes the doctor. Look, Joshua. We can follow him. Can I move that out of the way? Well, he's standing around doing nothing. Good, so let's press F6. And open hospital. Required rooms for section area office. Let's open the hospital. We are now open. So people are going to start turning up. Oh, there goes the doctor. Let's stop following him. We have our nurse as well. Bill Grayley. No. <laughs> Grace Bailey. <laughs> can I turn off follow? Yes, we can. Where's the doctor going? He's like wandering around. We probably have far too... Oh, look, someone's sick. Let's just slow this down a bit and have a look. So, patient journal. Good luck. We've done that. Okay. Uh, pol Hospitalised. Polyclinic. So, he's male. He's... Oh, invoice. There we go. We made some money. Ace 31 reports horrendous fever, excruciating sore throat, unusual fatigue. So what's been given to this one here? Patient consultation. I don't know whether we should be able to see whether he's she's been given anything. Uh, we're at the moment unable to examine further our current equipment and the patient was referred to another hospital. Oh, okay. Yep, she's been paid. Reputation plus four. Excellent. She's jumping in the bus. So I guess he's going to go in next then, is he? We've got more patients turning up. What's wrong with this guy? What's he saying? He's like running around doing nothing. Oh, here we go. This one's going in. So he's talking to the doctor. Let's have a look. They're having a little chat. And what's he going to say? <laughs> Let's speed it up. I want to see what he's going to... Oh, okay, he's invoiced him. I think we probably have to close that and open it again. Not refreshing very quick, is it? There we go. Unable to set a diagnosis. Okay, so what more do we need then? What other options do we have of things to build? So we've got all the walls and doors, doors, the tiles, vital signs, EKG. So we've got machines that we can put in. Examination bed. That would probably be a good idea. So let's put an examination bed in. Here. That's cost us 400. What have we got? 27,000. So we're okay. And operation bed. Not going to do that. Vital signs. EKG. Blood analyzer. Oh, hang on. We've got a message. Uh, yep, yeah, we're still trying to do that one. We're at 86. Board of directors. The road to a large hospital is long. Your first task is to build a doctor's office, hire the necessary personnel. Mission goals, one reception, one office, one doctor, one of two nurses. Let's do that one first then. Let's just move that over there. Oh, what other ones have we got over here? So these are our patients. Opinion bad, undiagnosed. So it doesn't actually tell us what, what we need to diagnose them. What's this? Consultation in progress. I wonder whether he's going to come back in again. He seems a bit happy, unless that's someone else. I'm not entirely sure. What's this one here? It's probably, yeah, overall hospital information. Okay, email. What's this? Oh, my goodness. Ah, this is what, it, what we need for the different things. Okay. Oh, and that's our settings. Right, okay. Well, let's hire another nurse then. Uh, applicant... Nurse. She looks better. Let's hire her. She looks like the best one. 
So let's go to this one. Yep, yeah, we've done. Reputation 10. Well, we've got more than that. So we've finished that one. Excellent. We're at 98 as well, so we can actually finish this one. 98 out of 87. And it gives us an extra couple of... Oh, I see. It gives us a bonus reputation. We need to expand our wards, Wilson. Hmm? Wilson Gavin should be hospitalised. Oh, okay. <laughs> Gavin Wilson. I thought he was calling me Wilson. That was confusing. Gavin Wilson should be hospitalised. We don't have any spare beds, so we need some wards. Okay. If the equipment to examine and treat a patient is missing, the doctor will refer the patient to another hospital. Let's have a quick sip of tea. We need a tea machine in here. The patient will still have to pay for the consultation. If he's preferred, give your hospital some good reputation. Okay. So we need a ward in here. So maybe, let's do an expansion up here then. What do we need for a general ward? 9 by 128 and a hospital bed. That's easy enough. Um, let's build a white wall. So we've got... So that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do that. Oh, can't place it. Eight, nine. Uh, one, two, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So if we go down, in fact, do you know what I'm going to do? No, don't do that. So I'm going to go all the way along to here. There we go. Then we're going to add... So we have double doors in here. Through to the ward. I think that'll be good. And let's have... What have we got here? Medical beds? Hospital beds. Oh, we need flooring as well, don't we? Let's have some white tiles. Yep. There we go. Who's this standing around here? Oh, is this the other nurse? Look. <laughs> That's the other nurse that we've got. <laughs> Alright, let's grab... Uh, we've got examination bed. Hospital bed. So I'm going to leave space. If I do one there, leave two, one there, leave two, then we can have some equipment down the side. Operation bed, medical locker. Let's have one of those. Not quite sure what's in there, but let's see. Let's see what those guys can do. Let's speed them up. So hopefully... Oh, look at all the deliveries we've got. Hopefully we've got enough stuff here to start dealing with some of the conditions we've got. What she's got? Oh, she hasn't been seen yet. She's a nurse. Where's the other guy? There he is. So, where could we find out? Aiden Prince. Is there an easy way? Doesn't... Oh, he's gone. Next time we have a patient, let's have a look. One that's been diagnosed. He's not being diagnosed yet. There's no information about him. I want to... I want to... Oh, we've paused it. I want to find out the best way. Okay, she's going in. When she comes out, I want to sort of follow the process through here. Find out the best way. Okay, let's slow this down. It's not been updated yet. Does she need to sit down before it's updated? Fever and cough. <laughs> She's seen the doctor. Okay, there we go. Let's pause the game. Unable to set a diagnosis. So, diagnosis. So, we can't see. She had fever and a cough. So, let's have a look up here. Uh, it wasn't that one. What's her name? Orbi Ramirez. Uh, which was the one that we needed to look at and it would tell us. Not that one. Not that one. That's the hiring. Where is the one that gave us the list of all the stuff? What could be wrong with people? Hospital, capacity, bank account. I know it's here somewhere. Oh, here we go. This is the one. So she's got fever and cough. Uh, okay, let's have a look. Blood analysis, blow test, CT, EKG, uh, physical... So it might be that we just need some basic equipment in here. He's got the beds. Because there isn't fever and cough listed. I bet that's what it is. Okay. So. Let's add in some machinery for this guy. Let's get things going again. Let's add some basic machines. You can have an EKG machine. A vital signs machine. A blood analyzer. That would probably be somewhere in the nurse's room. Let's chuck it in and see. How's this getting on? Oh, they're doing good. They're filling in the floor. Let's fill that up. So hopefully that will help him 
be able to work on some of the illnesses we've got. And then we need to set this as a ward, don't we? Let's just... Oh, it's not finished yet. Let's wait for it to be finished. So, while we're waiting for that to be finished, let me know in the description what you think of this game so far. It needs some polish, obviously. It is early access. But I think it could be fun. Oh, here we go. We've got a new message here. Extend your hospital with one examination room. Okay, we'll get to that. Mm, yep, yeah, we've got our ward that we're building. We'll come back to that in a minute. When they, oh, let's read it now while we're still waiting. Uh, the patients have to be... Yeah, we read that one, don't we? So it doesn't actually... A bit more information about what machines we need to sort of help people. I suppose it's one of those things you'll sort of learn as you go along. But if you would like to see more of Hospitalize, let me know in the description below. In the description. Well, I'd be clever if we could do that. Let me know in the comments below. Store. Don't know what that does. Oh, here we go. Is it finished? No, they've still got walls to be done. Come on, guys. They're working away. How are these guys doing? Can't diagnose him. Oh, he's got a lot of stuff. Look. Oh, there we go. They're building the things now. Undesirable increased hunger. Obviously not eating enough chocolate. That's what the problem is there. I wonder whether I could just adjust the options here. Let's turn up the sound effects. Turn down the music. Got to get that on 10. Got to get it on 10. Won't let me get it on 10. Oh, I got it. There we go. Let's resume our game. Oh, they've finished building. No, they haven't. Where have they all gone? Are they all taking a tea break or something? What are they doing? <laughs> no idea. Okay, I want to see a patient go in here and be and be fixed up. Go on, see the doctor. Is he going to see anybody? He's saying, next patient, please. Is that what you're saying? Someone coming in? No. Anybody? Oh, oh, here we go. Okay. So we've got Emily R Ramirez is back again. They're still building these walls. Let's wait until she sits down. Okay, she's got up. Is she... Oh, she's walking through the walls. Where's she going to go? <laughs> she's seen the doctor. No, I don't want to to the chair. Is it like a refresh? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I want the information now to see what's happened. Oh, the nurse is like wandered outside as well. <laughs> oh, she's walking around again. Is she going to leave? She's trying out another chair. She's like, yep, yeah, we're going to try a different chair. Oh, she's back to see the doctor again. Okay. Oh, man, this is, like, nearly finished. Let's speed that up again. Oh, she's had something to say, then. Let's keep the game going. See, why doesn't he use the... Oh, she's, like, disappeared, isn't it? Why doesn't... Let me use some of these. Nope, still no... Oh, there we go. Unable to... Hmm... Let's wait until this is finished. Maybe these things need to be in here. I don't know. Okay, they're nearly done. Let's just speed it up and get that done. Uh, what else do we need in the ward, did it say? Office, a general ward. All we need is hospital beds. So, we've got hospital beds. The wall's finished. There we go. Let's set that. So, hopefully... That's done. There should be some indicator when it's not done. Like, I would expect this hashing to go. That should be like a warning. The room isn't set yet. Okay, we have hospital beds. I know we do because I've put them in there. Hospital bed unoccupied. They're all made. They're all done. Yep. Let's just slow things down a sec. On. Well, I've selected it and I've done it. Let's see what the mission says. So which one was it? Expand our ward. No, not that one. Uh, finish. Give your hospital some good reputation. Reach 100. Oh, we've done that. Yep, let's finish that one. Extend your hospital with an examination room. No, we haven't done that one yet. Maybe we could put a little examination room down here. I reckon that's where these things need to go. 
examination room and the laboratory. Okay, let's add a little examination room. This has definitely got hospital beds. Look. Let's turn it off. Let's close it. Let's go back in. Let's select it. Yes, general ward on. We're done. Okay, we now have a hospital. I think I had to actually select on there again for it to work. Okay, well, there we go. That's okay. I mean, as we're getting to learn the little finicky bits, that's fine. Oh, what does a, an examination room need? 4x64, desk, office chair, chair, examination, bed, medical cabinet. So, actually, we've sort of done that with this, haven't we? But we could put one the other side. So let's build. How big did we do this? One, two, three, four, five. And then the wall. One, two, three, four, five. So six. And then it went along this one. Okay. That looks right, doesn't it? Yep. Good, good. Let's put a nice white tile floor in there as well. Let's speed this up. So it's going to be desk, office chair, chair, examination bed, medical cabinet. Well, we've got all of those things. So let's see. Let's maybe set this one up a bit differently. Let's have examination bed, uh, furniture, desk. Let's go for the desk. Which way around is that facing? Yep, the desk there. Office chair, yep, there. Patient's chair there. I'm going to have another patient's chair because, you know, sometimes you bring your husband or your wife to the doctor or your friend or a member of your family and it needed a medical cabinet, was it, as well? Uh, medical cabinet, yes. So let's put in a medical cabinet. There we go. That can go in the corner. There we go. Excellent. So what's this one got? Blood analyzer. I don't think these need to be in here. I think he needs a medical cabinet. I think that's what's missing. There we go. We're going to stick that against the wall in the corner. So he's got one as well. Maybe he needs that to look at people's illnesses and their needs. I'm not entirely sure. Let's wait for this to be done. Oh, it's almost done. They're finishing off the walls and then we can set what room it's going to be. Anybody using the hospital beds yet? No. I wonder if we could move these things, whether they need to be in there. Or whether they're set places they can go. I've sort of thrown them in there. Maybe he's not going to use those because we have other routes. Let's have a look. You see, we've got see x-ray scanner, pharmacy, counter, staff room, waiting room, reception area, laboratory, medical locker. Electrocardiograph. Yeah, I think these have to go in in certain rooms. Oh, here we go. Let's set this as examination room on. There we go. So we've done that one. Is that this one? Yes. Excellent. Some more reputation. Uh, we're going to need another doctor, aren't we, for there. So let's hire another doctor. Application doctor. Dr. Cooper. Cooper Parker. There we go. And he's arrived. He's like the twin brother of Dr. Joshua Phillips. That's fine. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to sell that. And I'm going to sell that. Because they just don't go in there, do they? Now we've got the medical cabinet. So how are how are we doing? Oh, examination's ordered. Physical exam and a prick test. So that's taking a blood example. That's what she wants. So we're now able... Are we going to have hers updated? Yes. Physical examination. Hospitalised. Oh, someone's been hospitalised. Let's just slow this down a minute. So she's had her physical exam in the examination room. I see. Does it say... She hasn't been diagnosed with anything particular. She hasn't been prescribed with anything yet. Right, this is getting interesting. Oh, man, look at the mess. Can we hire somebody to clean that up? Um, applicant... We already have caretakers, so maybe they should get on with that. Hopefully. We shall see. Anyway, yeah, let me know what you think. Shall we play some more? I think that I can see some potential in this, working our way through the different rooms that we need. I'm quite enjoying it. So if you did, leave a like. And don't forget to hit subscribe as well. If you like tycoon and management type games, you can see a few on the screen. I'm currently playing through Civilization VI as well. I've got a pre-release version of that. 
So if you enjoy those sort of things, I will see you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs> let's put this there. And let's sell that chair. And now people can actually get into the room. Okay? Thank you. Goodbye.